It's been really cool to have a, a family business uh, centered around horses, doing things that I love with both my parents. Um, it's been really cool to learn from them, especially my dad, Jan, uh, has, who's been my trainer for my entire life. Um, and now with Indeed, uh, my dad was actually the trainer for her uh, uh, leading up to Grand Prix, and now I'm really lucky to get to show her. Indeed was a horse that we purchased um, for me to ride, and I've shown her a couple of years in Grand Prix, and she did quite well. Um, she has been now with, with my son, Ben, for two months, two and a half months, and, and he's taken her over. Um, I think there's a time when, when you have to kind of pass some horses along to the younger generation, and it's for me fun to train with him and, and teach him and um, watch him at the shows and do really well. Everybody who's ever opened a bale of hay knows how much dust is in there. So in the good old days, you use the hose and you hose the stuff down to take care of the dust. And that was for me always the, the most important thing, get rid of the dust. Um, I think about two years ago, somebody introduced us to hay gain. And I thought that's a good idea. Uh, maybe much easier to take care of the dust that way. Um, but there are many more things about it. Uh, that you don't, might not think about what's, what's in the hay, it's not just the dust. I mean, there's like all sorts of fungus, bacteria. And what I love about the hay gain is that it takes care of all these things that are really not very healthy for the horses. The signs that we look for uh, when we're looking at a horse, at, we're, look, we're trying to figure out if it's a healthy horse or not, is the first thing is always the, the coat. If a horse has a shiny coat, um, then that's a good sign that a horse is probably on a good feeding program. Um, but there are other, other signs, uh, fitness, uh, endurance, performance in the ring, uh, the, the, what we feed, what we eat, what an athlete eats, and a horse is an athlete, is very important. Some horses are insulin sensitive, indeed seems to be one of them. And since we put um, her on the hay gain, uh, or used the hay gain, uh, as a, as a means to, to prepare her, her meals, her hay meals, we've seen an amazing uh, change in her. Just her coat looks better, her weight is better. Um, I think she's probably at a, at a place in her life where um, the training also has affected her that, that there's more muscle gain, but I think part of it is really due to the, the feeding that we're, that we're doing, that we have changed.